In the past, when people wanted to lose weight, you know, we talked about lifestyle changes, eating well and exercising well. And then we started supplementing that with a medication called like Benthamine, which increases metabolic rate and therefore they lose weight. Benthamine by itself stimulate maybe about five to eight percent weight loss. And for a long time, Phentermine with some other medications in combination has been really the mainstay treatment for weight loss. And then in 2014 is when the Sesenda came out. Once a day injection, GLP-1 agonist. What we noticed is that there was more weight loss than just Phentermine. And that range was between 10 to 12% weight loss. Then for a long time, there hasn't been any real sort of advances until 2021. And that's when the semaglutide, initially it came out as the brand name was Azempic for the treatment of type 2 diabetes. And then later on, it received uh, FDA clearance for weight loss. Then the brand was called Wagovi. Same medication, except the dosage is different. It's a once a week injection that targets the GLP-1 as well. And what we noticed with that was more weight loss than just once a day Sesenda. And that has been sort of the mainstay armamentarium that we had for weight loss. Then last year, Manjuro came out. And Manjuro is different than the previous classification because it targets two receptors, GLP-1 and GIP. And we think that this results in significantly more weight loss of 15 to 21%, which is a very significant difference. In practicality, what we have noticed is that in the past, we had patients on Wagovi and a lot of them did lose weight. However, there were some patients in which there really wasn't a significant response. However, with Manjuro, almost every single patient responds extremely well. And that's what we are really impressed by. And that really is the go-to medication now for weight loss patients.